how to create a Fiverr gig image design on Canva. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can create these gig images on Canva because a lot of us are trying to sell our services online using platforms like Fiverr. However, if you don't have a good image that is going to represent the type of gig that you are doing, then you might not be able to get the sales that you want. So I'll show you guys a couple of examples of good gig images, as well as the steps that you can take on Canva to actually create these images. Now, this is actually an image that I would recommend. These are good in the sense where the first image is showing a person as well as the service that they are providing. They are highlighting the service in super large fonts. Then after that, they are going to show the purpose of the service. So this will improve the website ranking. Then after that, they're providing multiple different pins of what type of uh, results that they are getting as well as the specifications of their service. So I'll show you guys how to create one like this over here. Now we're going to go ahead and you can do this for any niche. You might belong to any particular niche. That just really depends on wherever you are from. You can go on ahead and choose the service and you can easily customize the text according to your personal preferences. You will see white hat SEO, SEO services, diversified backlinks, drip feed to syncopation, white link hat building, boost website ranking, and more. So it really doesn't matter even if you're in web design, if you're a local creator, if you are a SEO optimizer, you can easily still use Canva to build these images. So for this, we're going to head on over into Canva. And once we go into Canva, you can search for Fiverr over here. Now, once you search for Fiverr, you will see Fiverr gig image templates. Now you can click on see all over here and you will see there are a bunch of gig image templates available. Now, you don't necessarily have to pick one out from here because you can really create your own. But if you want, if you like a particular template here, you can pick that out as well. But I am just going to open this up and you can see it's a 16 by 40 by 924. So 1640 by 924 canvas size and that's all you really need. So you can just create a canvas that is this size or you can use one of these templates. Now I'm not going to be using this so I'm just going to delete the content and I'm even going to delete the background. Now I'm going to go into elements and I'm going to search for background over here. And I'm going to click on see all. Once you click on see all, you can choose a type of background that you want. You don't want this to be super stylized because Fiverr is a place where you want a professional image. So make sure that the background that you are choosing is not too obvious. So you can just add a little bit of texture. You can add a slight color in the background. So I'm going to be using a bright blue color for this. And the reason we're using blue is because blue is often perceived as the most professional color. After that, I am going to add this light texture on top just so it is easier for people to actually see our listing and to give a professional yet stylized appearance. And I'm also going to go into the transparency of this. And then I'm just making this a bit transparent. Now from here, we are going to start adding our service and our own personal image. Now, if you have a headshot of yourself and you want to include that, which I do recommend because that just adds a personalization element that you're not going to find elsewhere. So you can click on uploads on the left and upload your own photo. I'm going to be using a regular old stock image. Now, with that, you don't just want to take your image. So let's say this is your image over here. You don't want to take this image and add it like this. Obviously, this is going to look really bad. So just upload your image. And once you put your image in the canvas, simply click on the image and then click on edit image on the top left. Once you do that, click on remove background. 
and your background will be removed. Now this is a pro feature on Canva. If you don't have Canva Pro, you can easily go on to remove.bg and on that website, you can do this for free. Now increase the size of your image like this and then place it on one side of the canvas. Then you're gonna go into text and click on add heading and then you're just going to place it over here. Click on the top left to choose the type of font. Now you can search for different type of font styles and just go on ahead and use a really bold font. You don't want something that can really be missed, but you also want something that looks professional as well. So I think I like this one over here because it looks super professional as well. Now I'm going to be creating a listing like this one. So I think I'm going to go with SEO services and I am going to add increase your website SEO ranking permanently like this, like so. And then I'm just going to resize this a little. Now I want to add a background to the back of this. And the reason why you want to add a background is because when you don't have a background, it's not gonna make your text really prominent. And you want your text to be super prominent. So you're gonna go into elements on the left and you can just search for blob and you can use one of these stylized blobs over here. Otherwise, you can simply go into the shape section in elements and then you can pick out one of these regular old shapes. So I'm going to be taking this rectangular shape over here and I'm just going to do this like so. Once I have the shape ready, I'm going to do command C and command V and I'm going to place it right at the same place. I'm going to slightly decrease the size of that one so it only covers the text. Then I'm going to click on layer and then click on send backward. And then I'm going to again alter the color so it provides more contrast as well. So I'm going to make it pure white like this and I'll select that so the placement looks really nice. And then I can go into the background blob and I can give that, you know, a dark color like this. Now once I've done that, I can go on ahead and add or highlight a particular service. So let's say I want to add 20 plus backlinks like this and this is something i want to highlight so i'm just going to add that click on effects and then you can click on hollow once you click on hollow you can increase the text color and you can also do outline outline usually works a bit better i personally prefer that and once i do that i can click on the outline color which i'm going to do as black and i'm going to go into my font color and convert that into white and I can just copy and paste this and then I can add the second highlight of my service which might be permanent SEO improvement or permanent SEO like this. So once you do that, you can just click on share, click on download and download this as a PNG for your Fiverr services. And just like that, you have a professional Fiverr gig image ready. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.